and out of the terror arrest in Georgia, where the FBI thwarted a possible attack on the White House and other high-profile sites, taking a 21-year-old in custody the day before he was planning to launch a deadly assault. Our Chief Justice Correspondent Pierre Thomas is tracking the case. Good morning, Pierre. George, good morning. The FBI today is laying out a chilling tale involving a proposed suicide attack that was supposed to happen today, January 17th, here in Washington. Among the targets considered, the Washington Monument, the Lincoln Memorial, and a specific synagogue. But the most detailed and focused planning involved a plot to attack the White House with a three-man team using assault rifles, hand grenades, and an anti-tank rocket launcher. The plan was to cause a distraction, breach the White House grounds, blow a hole in the mansion, and then proceed to kill, quote, as many people as possible and do the most damage, George. And thank goodness the FBI was able to get wind of this in order to set up the sting operation. That's right, George. The FBI says that Hashir Tahib, 21, was arrested yesterday after he attempted to trade his car for the weapons. But it was all a sting, as you said. The weapons were fake, and the other terrorists that Tahib thought he was dealing with were actually undercover FBI operatives posing as radicals. The case began last March when local police contacted the FBI and told them that Tahib had been radicalized. The FBI sent undercover informants to make contact with Tahib, who allegedly began discussing his allegedly deadly operations. He said, quote, Jihad was the best deed in Islam, George. You've got to be vigilant. Okay, Pierre, thanks very much. So many great organizations and agencies doing their best to keep us safe here. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.